All right, so here are views of version three. Now, we're already on version four and working on version five, but this was important to show because this is where I started to learn, and it me meant that I had to fail here using the stiffer PETG material before I could get to the better flexible one. So let's see what I was thinking. Here we are, version three. So you can see here, obviously some model issues here, but I, this, is a, this is a prototype. Okay, but basically we're gonna make sure the fit didn't change. I made some of those walls thicker on the inside, but the big change is the bristles. So instead of single strings, they're now just long walls, I guess you could call them, but this should make stronger, which means it should make it last longer. And if we've got any issues on them breaking where they connect here, I've got a plan for that, but we'll see. Let's find out. Okay. Well, it goes in. That's good. <laughs> that could be a problem. Oh, boy. <laughs> eh, I'll trim those. We'll see how well it works. All right. Cut down the size, you know, so we'll see what happens. The plan would be to go with an even stronger material, but I don't want to print with that expensive stuff until I know that the design works. So back into the grind of the prototype. And so here you can see I changed it so that I gave the blade a little bit more of an angle. And here is where I started realizing, oh, this should be flexible. And the, the design that I did here actually worked well for the flexible. So we'll tell you more about that on the next one.